Welcome back everyone to another episode of Kingdoms of Amalurie Reckoning. Oh my god. No sound effects. Great. Oh, this is Malwin. Well, you know what we're going to do. We're going to pop this. I knew he was going to die in one hit. Come on, bro. Where's he gone? Did he leave? Oh, he's up there. We can't attack that. Where is he? He's here. Well, that was a waste. You missed. <laughs> I even blocked there as well. I could swear I broke my shield. This is our chance. Before they can regain control of the creature. Do it. Theoden, guide my hand. For the fear! You can tell this is an old game. The sounds are so broken. We're gonna take that. Coins. Take the potions. I probably won't use them, but I'll take them. Pursue Baylor. Do we just jump down? I'm guessing we gotta go through here. That was a good timing though. It was a good timing on that last episode. It's like one step away from a cutscene. I thought he was shooting at me then. All right, bro, calm you. down. You're still alive. You've got to destroy Baylor before it tears this place apart. You seem to be enjoying yourself. This is what I was born to do. I thought I would never fight a battle like this for the rest of my life. All the ale in the world couldn't make me feel like this. But you've got to press on and stop the Baylor. It's tearing this fortress apart. Okay, yes, sir. Let's go. 
You can tell when there's enemies nearby, the camera just changes. Oh, I just one shot him. I want that chest. Cost one lockpick to get five. I guess it was worth it. I wonder if we'll actually get to like use a finisher on that Baylor. I'm just gonna leave these guys. I just wanna kill the Baylor now. We can kill these guys. They're sort of in the way. Oh, we got one of these again. He's gonna run at me. I hate how you can't dodge that. Yeah, you can't dodge it. It doesn't do much damage like, but yeah, you can't dodge it. These chakrams are like, they're just better than the sword now. What happened? Oh, we'll leave the boxes for now. Eh, don't want any of that either. I'd like the gates to open a bit quicker. Oh, is this it? Nope. That hurts though. Run. Run. Oh, I need that. Oh, just got me. I think my health regen will be okay. Oh, these are those guys that get on my nerves. They move so fast. The gates take too long, you might as well just leave them open. You want me to come in there and get you? Oh my god. I want to use reckoning mode. And I could use it right now, but he's flinched. Yes. Oh, I'll take that. Let's see if that's good. Nope. Secondary. So what was it? Was it called the Harpy? I oh know, Chaos Stem. Where did I get the Harpy from? Here we go. How is that even dodgeable? Come on. I can't even see what's going on. Oh, I did something. Oh, that was a lot of damage. Oh, here we go. Should I just block? Oh, it works. Just wait for the second one. Here we go. And now he's stuck. One more should do it. We just stand and block now. His breath makes me flinch. The reason I've not used reckoning mode is because I, th I think it's going to give me a finisher regardless.
Come on. That one missed completely. There we go. I think this is it. This is awesome. I was waiting for a button prompt. That was quick. We got another level up. More into Sagecraft. I'm just throwing points willy nilly now. The two Arthur. They're gone. After ten years. I can't believe they're finally gone. Mel Sanchez is free. It's over. After all these years, the siege is broken, and we're alive. Thank the gods for sending you to us. This is a glorious day, but I have heard a bitter rumor in the wake of all of this. Is it true? Has Talera fallen? Talera gave her life to save us. Then the rumors of her dishonor will finally be silenced. She gave everything to us in the end. And the world will know that. When we rebuild these walls, we'll name them after General Talera. Her memory will stand as long as the ramparts shine. But she never would have been here had you not delivered her to us. It can never be enough, but we hope you'll accept this as our thanks. Don't I get a parade? Better. You get what every soldier dreams of. A break. Rubble from the fight is still blocking the main gates, and it'll be a few days before we can get outside again. Meanwhile, your friend Agarth here says he's got a lead on an old friend of yours. Sounds like it might be useful. 4% more XP, look. How can I help you? You can't. You just spoke to me by me pressing B. Seems like a lifetime since the king was telling you to find allies. You really took that to heart, didn't you? Good thing you won't be facing it alone. In fact, I've got a lead on finding an old friend of ours. What old friend? Old Felmerus Hughes, of course. If anybody can help, it's bound to be the gnome who brought you back to life. I've been asking around and I was able to make contact with his superior. He thinks he might be able to help find Hughes. Who is Hugh's superior? All gnome scholars have a Templar who sponsors their research. And apparently Hughes' sponsor, Templar Octien, is desperate to find him. Go southwest to the Hollowlands and Detir. Octien will be waiting there to discuss how you might reach Hughes. Fair enough. Let's get going. The next ship out of here is heading for Rathir. Are you interested in coming aboard? Take me to Rafia. To Rafia we go. We need to get out of this city now. A few days and I'll be headed back. When it comes to long travel like this, I'm probably just going to speed these things up. Either that or cut it out, depending on how long it is. So now we gotta go south. I don't think anything interesting is gonna happen. 
I mean, anything beats that island where Dead Kill was. There was like nothing there. Let's just check the map. Oh god, that's a long way. It's going to be faster to go here. I think what I'm going to do is not go that way. Uh, oh, I know what's going on. I know where we are. So I'm going to get to the next area. We've already wiped this place out before. I'm actually just going to run away from this stuff. Yeah, we did a full, well, not a full episode, but we did this entire camp in it in one episode. Just run! Yeah, I think I'm going to get to the area where we're supposed to go. Like that, that southern section, and then we'll see how long we've been recording for then. Stranger, please. I am being hunted by Fair Gorta. The bones of all my forebears mean to kill me. Your ancestors are Fair Gorta? They are the bones of all my fallen family. I am of an ancient line, and the curse it bears is almost as old. When a scathe dies, the magic of the curse raises his bones and forces them to hunt its descendants. Nothing of its life remains. Just a hunger for scathe blood. They will not stop until the line is dead. And I fear I am the last. But this curse need not end with my death. If you are willing to help me. I'll help what's needed. I must exile myself from my family. In ancient Alfar tradition, members of the family or clan could be banished forever with the proper ceremony. This stronghold was my family's seat. It contains a solemn bell, the Codex Scathe, and my birth candle. All components for the ritual of banishment I must complete. We should begin. Meet me in Dove Whale, and we shall get underway. Stay quiet. Yeah, I just spoke to him thinking that he'd leave me alone, or maybe his family spawned on him or something. Obviously, that's not the case. I think we have to go up here. Yeah, so he's just going to get ignored for now. Oh my god. Gold? Nope, we don't have to go up here. Well, we'll kill these. We're practically there as it is. Okay, okay. Come on, be nice. Do I use Reckoning Mode? Yeah, we'll, we'll use it. Screw it, why not? Let's get rid of these. Well, at least we're going to finish this up with hopefully something decent. All dead. That was a nice batch of XP. Yes. No loot. 
I'm going to grab this, but I'm going to end the episode here and then grab it. Because we've only got to go jump off there and round the corner. So thank you guys for watching. Until next time, bye-bye.